What's really good, man? It's your man again. It's Friday. The first time I saw the shoes in a magazine. Um, none other than Soul Collector magazine. This was also circulated on Nike Talk. But it was not a general release. Am I excited to see the shoes today? Um, yes. I think it would have been dope if the shoes were actually released. Maybe back in the day and then retro again in our same colorway. I mean, if you look at shoes like... The Jordan 4, the Cool Grays. Cool Grays haven't been out since 2004. That was the only time it dropped, and I haven't seen that. I hope Jordan Brand brings those shoes back. I've had these shoes sitting in my trunk for a minute uh, since Tuesday, and I want to just cut this open, um, show you guys um, my new ones pickup. I do have that open now. I think I definitely did cut this from the bottom, so get this from Nike, and then, so this is what we got basically, uh, the box, cool looking box, I think this is what we've seen in all the retro fours and fives. <laughs> Alright, so we got the um, this little plastic thing, you know. and so this is basically the shoes. Let me sit this right here. Yeah, this is the shoe. Um, the shoes are still sitting in stores, so hopefully, wherever you live, you can uh, still cop them. At this point, I don't know. I feel like this shoes is definitely going to sit in stores. They're not going to sell out. It will definitely make it to the outlet for sure. And either way, I still picked the pair up anyways. This was the pair that Nike reserved for me, so I ended up purchasing it. Um, I don't really purchase um, most of the shoes that Nike have been reserving for me because they never give me any any good shoes. I feel like they have they have the data of the shoes I've been buying. So if you want to reserve something for me, it should be something that you know I'll, I'm definitely gonna buy. Well, this one for sure, I bought it. If you reserve a shoe for me on a Thursday, it would definitely be great to have the shoes and you know just have it. But I had to wait till Tuesday because it was not free shipping. Now I know some of you guys are gonna be like. You could have just paid 25 bucks. Now, why would I do that? These shoes are still sitting in stores. I think these are great shoes. Will I wear them? I don't know. I don't know. At this point, I feel like I have so many shoes. I have so many shoes. And sometimes I even question myself, why are you even buying this? Because I'm never going to end up wearing them. I have a lot of fours that I haven't worn. I sold one. The, the, the Mars... Yeah, the Mars that was released some years ago, maybe 2006, 2007. I saw those shoes. I don't remember the date correctly, but to let you guys know what I'm talking about. So we're looking at the Silk Collector magazine, right? This right here is uh, issue number 34. Uh, it doesn't really have a date on here, so I couldn't even tell you when it was dropped. I miss this, man. This was back in the day, something I always look forward to. So you look at that. You see, 2007, you have the Jordan Motorsports, which is like, uh, right, right there. Okay, we got the Jordan Motorsports right there, and that was it. This, this, this was the only thing we saw. Um, everything else was never like released to the general public, but this also. This particular pair in here looks exactly like the Force. Um, where is it? It looks exactly like the Mars that was released uh, back in the day. I had a pair of those. I sold it to a friend of mine I used to work with. So, um, unfortunately, I don't have that shoe in my collection anymore. But it's definitely cool to see this, you know, to see this um, in person. Um, Again, I saw the shoes in a store 
in LA prior to you know the release date, and for me, I wanted to wait. But what it means to a cat like myself, who's been buying shoes for so many years, you know, um, it means something totally different from somebody who just started buying shoes like five years ago. You know absolutely nothing about this. You probably read read about this in magazines. I got my hands on the shoes today, and uh, it looks good. It looks good. Um, the the leather on here, I don't know. It just looks it looks the same as the military fours uh, that was released back in the day. Um, maybe fire red fours. I love these magazines. I really wish this never went away. But it would have been great if Soul Collector would actually bring those magazines back. You know, it was definitely something um, important to me. I loved, I loved the stories. I loved the covers that they always had on people's collection. But it looks like that's what Instagram is doing now. Everybody wants to show their little collection. So they do that on them pretty well, I think. Um, anyways, my John 4 pickup and uh, in-car unboxing. <laughs> um... I like the shoes again thanks for checking out this video if you like it if you like the shoes let me know what you think about it in the comment section below um, definitely link up on social media hope you stay safe wherever you at have a great weekend one love peace